three, two, one. Hey guys, from my channel, I am going to ask you, this is like a Mr. Beast fundraiser, but real quick, let's see, Miss like, uh, Chandler, since you can see LA City, I'm trying to judge, my best guess is Chandler is... How tall is Chandler from Mr. Beast? Six feet and five inches. According to Alexa Answers, Amazon.com, Chandler is six feet and five inches tall. How tall is Chris? According to Arealnews.com, Chris the Meme God, Chris Tyson biography stands at a height of five feet ten inches. Dang! He looks so cool that it, Chris you used to wear a tuxedo more often. Oh god, you look like you're just about to buy. You look like you're a Walmart exec if you wore that. I know what you should do for your next video. Uh, act like CEOs for a day, and then give ten thousand dollars to charity. Sit like give all that money like uh like Ferrari. Give it to a homeless person like that. And then look like you're a multi-millionaire. I think you'd probably try that. Because that, that picture is sick. I would never be able to get that cool look. I am so jealous. I am so jealous of your looks right now. You look like you're a multi-billionaire. And I can't, I don't know why, but you just look so sick. It just looks like, you did buy, yeah, I just bought a half a million dollars yesterday. You did? Yeah, at investment firms. Alright. How tall is Jimmy? Oh, wow. How fast can Chandler run? Doesn't tell me. But it, what I see is Chandler's the tall one. So... I like to see a video of Chandler running faster than cars, and every time he loses, every time he wins, the person has to give them their car. But if they lose, the person gets to keep their car, but if he beats your car, you lose it. Entirely. You lose the right to own your car, and Chandler gets your car because he beat you with it. And you get to beat him, like you get to run, if you can run faster than him, you get to get your car back, or you get to have a Ferrari. Signed by Chandler, who beat you in the first place. There. That's a challenge. That's something I would accept. I'll just go, I can run faster than Chandler. You know, I'm probably slower than, slower than a Model T, but meh. Personally saying this, Chandler, if you want to race me, bring it on, bring it on, Chandler. Wait, the guy in the blue, the guy with the uh, graffiti shirt, Chandler, correct? Um. Oh, guys, the reason I picked this video is this is the only video I found that has them all sitting there next to each other, staring at the camera awkwardly, especially Chandler. I'd like to congratulate Chandler, because he's going to be my nightmare tonight. Don't do that, Chandler. Don't do this. You're scaring me. Chandler, why are you staring at the camera? Do you have a teleprompter that I don't see because my glasses are not on my face? But that is... Chandler is just creepy. Let me just cover up his eyes so I don't see him. Mr. Beast's head is covered in chat bubbles. But... Oh my... God, um, Chandler is really creepy right now. He's just staring into my soul. Why are you staring into my soul, dude? Why? 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 Are you alive? Are you alive, Mike? Hello? Are you alive, Mike? Huh. Look at this. I, I watched it. I haven't watched it in a couple of while ago, but look, it's happening or passing.
And yes, the Jay Leno show is still funny. Oh, no, no, it's even more scary. He's like, I still can see you. That's just creepy. That's just creepy. <laughs> That's just creepy. That is just messed up, Chandler. Next time, don't stare me down like that. I was like, oh, this is going to be a nice video to show on my YouTube channel. Look at Chandler's face. Oh, my God. You are staring me down.